Well, the long-awaited solar eclipse is just around the corner. A lot of people looking forward to it. And for those of you who may not be able to travel to see the full eclipse on Monday, the good news is you will not have to travel far to see the next one. Solar eclipses in general are mainly about right, being in the right place at the right time. And to see the full solar eclipse in 2017, the right place isn't exactly close to Cincinnati. It's about a three and a half hour drive to the path of totality right now in 2017. In 2024, it's literally a half an hour drive to see totality. Seven years from now, the U.S. will experience another solar eclipse, and that will be the one you will not want to miss here in the tri-state. Places like Harrison, Ohio will get a total eclipse, while us here at the Cincinnati Observatory are going to get 99 percent. This is because the path of the eclipse will change. The eclipse in 2017 is going from coast to coast from Oregon to South Carolina, and the eclipse in 2024 will go up from Mexico, Texas, and then through Ohio. Dean Regas of the Cincinnati Observatory Observatory says the visuals Monday here in Cincinnati won't be as good. The moon is expected to cover about 90% of the sun, but in 2024, the light will diminish pretty significantly. You will notice that it's a little darker. The shadows coming through things will look a little sharper. You'll kind of sense there's something weird in the air. <laughs> Starting at 1 in the afternoon on Monday, Thomas More College is having a special viewing for students to catch a glimpse of the eclipse. To see other places in the area that are having eclipse viewings, all you have to do is visit our website at WCPO.com. And we all know one thing is really important for this, the weather. Yeah, you have to yeah. have clear